This is a jet mini lathe. This is your hand wheel, headstock, spindle. The spindle has a number two Morse taper in it. This is a drive spur that normally comes with a lathe. This drive spur has a matching uh, Morse taper. Fits in here like this. And once that's in there and you put pressure against it, the way to take it out is to use the knockout rod, put it through the hole that's going through the spindle, and knock it out. It's a good idea <clears throat> to hold your hand so it doesn't drive it into your hand. So grasp, grasp it with your fingers. This is your banjo and your tool rest. This is a tailstock. The components of the tailstock are you've got a hand wheel, you've got a quill, and then you've got a lock mechanism here to lock the quill into place. And then there's another lock here to lock the tailstock to the ways. This quill has a number two Morse taper as well. The live center has a matching number two Morse taper on it, and it fits into here, and it's a pressure fit. So you get it in there like that, and once you put pressure on it to turn your piece of wood, you've got to get this out of the quill. To get it out, back the hand wheel up, and it will eject it automatically right out the front. If that's difficult to do, then you probably got a little bit of a burr in here or maybe some, you need to oil this. I, I oil mine every once in a while. Now that quill needs to be taken out every once in a while. To take it out, loosen up the set, the set screw here. Hold it with your fingers. Crank turn it. clockwise on the tail stock uh, hand wheel. And what that does is it ejects it completely from the whole system. And you can see the female threads in here and this groove that runs along here. It's a good idea to lubricate the lead screw that's inside and the threads here and clean your Morse taper occasionally. To put it back in, just slide it into place, turn your hand crank counterclockwise now, and you can see it's starting to feed it in. Now carefully find place where this goes into this groove and what that does is keeps it from spinning okay. thank you there you go Lucy